Alright you guys, I just wanted to do a quick video on how to connect your Cronus Zen with the Zen Apex and the Azron Gaming Keypad. Now, I couldn't figure it out for a while of how to get all three of these things to work together. So, I did a little bit of research and for some weird ass reason, like, if you plug up the Azron Keypad with... You know the normal usb hub that comes with the zim apex it works completely fine but if you try to run the the azron plugged up to the zim apex and then running it to the krona zen which is this it'll it'll flash on and off like it wasn't getting power so the first thing i was thinking okay you know maybe they, i got a bad one sent so i plugged it up to my pc on the PC, it lit up perfect. It worked fine and everything. So I was like, the only other thing I could think of is it's not getting enough power. So I went on Amazon and I looked up a company called uh, StarTech. And that company, StarTech, they sell a USB power hub. You gotta excuse the wiring because I'm still messing with this right now. But it's a StarTech. 3.0 USB hub that supports up to four inputs and then you just have you know the USB that's gonna run from here Let's see if I can get in the camera Pretty much you can get it from running from right here that goes into The the Zim and then you got your separate wall power plug right there So the way I got it to work was that you know, I said, you know what, if it's not going to be reading through the through the PS, the Zim Apex's USB hub, I'll eliminate that. Just buy me a, a, a USB power hub, which I paid $38 for same day shipping. I ended up going ahead and plug in the PS4 controller on one side, uh, the Razer Viper mini mouse in the middle, and then the Azron as the third input. And then... The wire that's right here, this wire, I have it running straight directly from the USB power hub over to the Zim Apex. From the Zim Apex, on the other end of it, you plug it into your Krona Zen. And from the Krona Zen, once this is powered up, this end right here from the from the from the Krona Zen goes over to the PS4. Now if you're wondering how did I get the Zim Apex, you don't care about the Azeron, none of that, and how did I get the Zim Apex to work with the Cronus? Now, a lot of people have asked me this question. To get the Cronus Zen to work, even with the original Cronus and Cronus Zen, you need the first gen PS4 controllers for it. Meaning, the PS4 first gen has the light bar right here. If it was a newer controller, it would have the light bar on the touchpad. That will not work. You need to find an old school first gen PS4 controller that has just the light bar here, not on the touchpad, but right here. Once you get that, it's gonna work flawless with the Corona Zen. The Zen Apex will work. And to set it up again, like you just plug up the Cronus up, have it powered up, and then the Zen Apex is gonna go on the left side of the Corona Zen. Now once I got all that powered up, you know, I came home from work, I powered everything up, and I was going to test it out, and sure enough, I mean, I'm able to move my character and still have my mod packs from the Cronus in and still use the Azron. And what I mean by the mod packs, I have one where I have a cancel reload, so when I hit the reload, it's supposed to do that. And... Say somebody's already shooting at me and I'm trying to reload at the same time Then all I got to do it does a, a cancel reload So I just shoot So say somebody's shooting at me right now and I'm reloading bam get rid of it Start shooting again. I'm shooting at me bam get rid of it That's one And then I also have the cancel reload where I slide uh, not cancel reload the cancel cancel slide So what it does 
And I have enough boost boosted up. It's supposed to slide jump. Slide jump. Slide jump. Slide jump. And they call that the cancel, cancel slide. Now, the other thing I have also on the mod pack for the Cronus in is I have uh, the aim assist intensity. Intensifier. So when I aim at somebody, it's supposed to shake my screen. If you see it right there, you can see that it's uh, it's shaking my screen. And it's supposed to follow the character, the enemy. But you can see how my screen shakes. You can barely see it a little bit, but... You see how it's trying to pull towards them? And I'm not even moving nothing. Look at that. It's trying to pull towards them. But in reality, if you already have decent aim and you use that, all you got to do is just fucking aim at them and start shooting. Because it's going to it's gonna already pull towards them. But if you have any questions on how to, you know, reconnect everything, like I said, you will need... If you want all three, which is the Azron, the Zim Apex, and the Krona Zen to work all together, the two main things you will need is a first-gen PS4 controller, which is the light bar on near the charging port, not on the not on the touchpad, and you will need a powered USB hub if you want all three of them to work together. But yeah, if you have any questions, uh, just leave a comment.